Understanding Straw in the Wind, Unveiling English Idioms. Hello and welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore a fascinating English phrase, straw in the wind. This idiom might sound simple, but it holds a lot of meaning. Whether you're a beginner or an advanced learner, understanding such phrases can greatly enhance your language skills. So, let's dive in and unravel the mysteries of this interesting expression. Straw in the wind is an idiom used to indicate a small sign or hint that foreshadows a larger event or trend. Imagine a single straw being blown in the wind. By itself, it seems insignificant. However, it can indicate the direction of the wind, giving us a clue about the weather to come. Similarly, in language, a straw in the wind is a small, seemingly minor detail that suggests a bigger change or event is on its way. The origin of the phrase, straw in the wind, is quite interesting. It is believed to date back to times when people were more in tune with nature and used natural signs to predict future events. Just as farmers might watch straws in the wind to gauge the weather, this phrase has come to mean observing small details to predict future trends or outcomes. It's a great example of how language evolves from everyday experiences. To better understand, straw in the wind. Let's look at some examples. 1. The sudden resignation of the manager was a straw in the wind, hinting at the company's financial troubles. 2. Her hesitation to answer the question was a straw in the wind, indicating that she was not fully prepared. In these sentences, small actions or events, resignation and hesitation, are seen as indicators of larger situations, financial troubles and unpreparedness. When using straw in the wind in conversation, it's often used to point out a subtle hint or clue about something larger or more significant. It's a great way to sound insightful and perceptive. For example, I think those minor policy changes are a straw in the wind for a major shift in government approach. And that wraps up our exploration of the phrase, straw in the wind. Remember, idioms like this are the straws in the wind of language learning, they give you a glimpse into the rich and colorful nature of English. We hope this video has been enlightening and useful in your journey to mastering English. Happy learning, and see you in our next video.